Hello, hello, and welcome to Sunny's View on this channel. Today, do I have a treat for you? How many times have you gone out to your local grocery store and bought your favorite detergent, only to discover that it costs what fifteen to twenty some odd dollar for a large size of your favorite detergent? Well, I went by my local Dollar Tree today. I'm gonna pick this up, one dollar. This says twenty five percent more. This is the Fresh and Clean laundry detergent. This comes in the size of a 24 ounce. One thing about detergent, it is to cleanse the dirt from your clothes. Now, if you have severe stains, you're gonna to to treat those stains. You gotta learn how to treat the stains. 24 ounces in this box. I bought four. So we're talking about $4. This Oxy All Clean Fresh, $1. I bought some of this Sun Color Safe Bleach. It's a non chlorine Centrus Scent bleach will not discolor your clothes will not bleach your clothes where it's going to turn the coloration of your clothes but i'm going to show you how to mix all of this together now my favorite detergent is gains i love gains love the scent of game love it all now i'm going to tell you something about this right here this is some good fresh and this fresh and clean laundry detergent from your local dollar tree this is really good now they just put this on the shelf a day ago they sold out. They was restocking the shelf this morning. I said, let me go ahead and give me four of them. So you're gonna need a large container of such. This is all I have. I had the games box, but I somebody in my house threw it away. I ain't gonna say no names, raw it. But uh, we're gonna use this large detergent bo um, bucket. I bought this from the wholesale club a little while back. And I just kept the bucket for whatever household usage or cleaning the car, washing, mopping, whatever we need it for. But tonight I have no choice. I'm gonna mix everything inside of this. So what I decided to do tomorrow, I'm gonna go out and buy something bigger. But for time being, we're gonna use that. We're gonna take a trash bag. This is a 13 gallon trash bag. I'm gonna take this bag, open it up, and I'm gonna line the inside. I'm gonna take it and line the inside of my butt. Now, in order to do this, you're gonna need a large container. You can't use something small. And make sure you have a lid to it because anytime you have powder like this and you don't have a lid, sometimes it tends to clump up on you. You don't want that to happen. Sonya, is that safe for my HE washing machine? I have a newer model washing machine. It's safe to use. I have one as well. I have the washer and the dryer. My washing machine is only about two, three years old. You can use this. In your new machine because all the church it now they're making it where it's safe to use in the newer machines so none of that old stuff they used to do this is what they're using let me look on the side right quick y'all know good damn well i can't see without them glasses but trust and believe it's safe enough for let me see on this side here they got the english version on here somewhere oh lord how mercy Put it this way, I'm gonna leave all the information down below, but try it. Don't knock it till you try it. At least try it. Six dollars, can't beat it. So let's go ahead and get to mixing so I can wash clothes. Cause these kids been wanting to wash clothes, but I told them you want to hold off until I do this video because I need my people to start saving money. We're shopping at Dollar Tree, but we're gonna get the most for our dollars when you come over here to Sonya B on this channel. We're not wasting any more money at Dollar Tree because the wasted dollars could have been invested in something else. So come on, let's get started. Okay, so I've opened the boxes. This is the detergent. The Fresh and Clean laundry detergent I purchased from my local Dollar Tree. If you look on the inside, that's fairly a lot of detergent for this one little box for $1. I've taken a 13 gallon trash bag and lined a old bucket that I had laying around, just sitting around the house. I lined it like this because I don't have the top for it, so I need to tie it in a knot. Okay, so the first thing you want to do, you know, for all that, that's my second box, third box, that is my fourth box, so that fresh and clean. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add this non-chlorine color safe bleach by Sun. I wanna go ahead and add that in the And now I'm gonna go ahead and add my OxyClean. 
I'm gonna add that entire jar to that. The only thing about this, it does not come with a scoop. So while you're at your local Dollar Tree, you can pick up your measuring devices and use this to measure the amount of detergent you want to use to wash your clothes with. Or you can use, inside of this container of this OxyClean comes this little scoop. You can use that if it's, you're a single person and you don't wanna use that much detergent, this would be the perfect measuring device to use to wash your clothes with. So now what I need to do is mix everything together. I'm gonna to take a spoon. There's nothing wrong with taking a house spoon to mix everything up very well. I'm gonna mix it up very well. Okay, so since I had the measure, extra set of measuring device, I will be using this one fourth cup as my measuring device when I wash my clothes since I have a large family. But like I stated, if you don't have a large family, you can use, in this Oxyol, you can use the small measuring cup to wash your clothes with. So you can use either or. I may just, I'm gonna stick both of them in here. So if the kids have like a small load of clothes they need to wash, they can use this. But if they have a large tub full of clothes, they can use this. Now once you mix it up very well, it should have some blue undertones to that whiteness. And now you're ready to wash your clothes. Now your spoon, if you use a house spoon, just put it over in your dishwasher and it'll come clean. There's nothing wrong with using a house spoon to mix this detergent up with. Don't go buy anything too extra. I spent a total of $6. That's it. Now, if I take this bag out of this container, that is how much, ooh, it got a hole in it. Y'all, you know what? When I tell you I got baby kids around here, Bay Bay children, but you best believe this is not gonna go to waste, honey. I'm gonna slide this going back up in this bucket. Yes, I am. Hold on, y'all. I wanted to show you, but this, this is a lot of detergent. I'm just gonna lift it up a little bit because it's wasting. That's a lot of detergent. But I had to put it like this because, like I told you, they threw away the top of this. So what I'm gonna do once I finish using it, I'm either gonna twist it, put it like this, and just gonna put it up on the shelf just like this. But I did not want it to leave it open in this container, so that is why I put it in a plastic bag inside of the container. But I did spill some on the counter. Waste not, won't not, so we're gonna scoop that up. And we're gonna wash this some clothes. Come on back, because I'm gonna show you how it's gonna clean your clothes so you won't be saying, well, Sonya, you had me buy this and then it's not doing a good job. I'm gonna show you, hands on, how we're gonna clean our clothes using this Dollar Tree Fresh and clean laundry detergent. Come on back, y'all. So, this bucket is really heavy. You can get anywhere from 100, I wanna say 125, 150 loads of this. It just all depends on how much you're gonna use. So I hope you've enjoyed the time we've shared together because every dollar counts, even while shopping at Dollar Tree. Until next time, be blessed.